Elsie has returned. Oh, her hair looks so good like that. Hey. Elsie. Pa, don't shoot. Let me explain. Elsie, get out of the way. I don't want to repeat the last time. What? Well, howdy all you cool creatures. I'm Cryptid, welcome to the Cryptid Plays YouTube channel. And today we are continuing my time at Sandrock. Last time, if you recall, I spent way too long giving my builder a makeover, but we also got Rosie integrated into Sandrock a bit better. And Elsie is still missing, so we're gonna have to wait for her to come back. But yeah, beyond that, there's story stuff underway. We did finish that unlocking mechanism, so Grace will probably get back to us on that soon. And yeah, we'll we'll see what happens. Now, the only warning that I have for you is the photosensitive epilepsy warning, but if there are any flashing lights, I will put a warning on the screen. So with that out of the way, let's get started. <gasps> this note is from Grace. It says to meet at the Sandrock storage at 12 a.m. I was about to say 12 p.m. and I'm like, that's not right. It's not at noon. It is literally at midnight. Okay. Oh boy. Getting that underway. And from Elsie. Cryptid. I was out in the desert today and I found its trail. Some sandfish bones. Must be right. Looks like regurgitation, like how birds feed their young. Hollett's book got a whole section on giant duck regurgitation. Anyway, I'm done packing. Gonna hit the road and track her down. I ain't gonna head back to Sandrock for a while. Please check in on my ma and pa, okay? I'll let you know when I found the duck. Signed, Elsie. I, I trust she's gonna be all right. Uh, let me you know I'm already missing my <laughs> my builder's long hair maybe I should uh go give him some long hair I know I'm so picky about how he looks I mean this is cute maybe I'll keep it I don't know yet hi Owen All right, they're fun. I missed the long hair too much. I gave him different things though, so. <laughs> also, I changed his uh, eyeshadow just slightly. So it looks like his eyes are bleeding black, but you know, that's cool. I love how the cats sleep with their faces on the ground. It's kind of sad. You know, there's something I really wanted to check. Hold on. So I'm curious about something because I think you can go to Logan's hideout without like once you finish there but I have no idea where it actually is on the map like I know the general area uh, the only problem with my character having long hair is that it goes through his uh, cape Sorry, this is mostly just my curiosity. So I've seen people go back and talk to him, so I'm like, can I go do that? I want to. But my terrible sense of direction will get me killed. If I'm not careful. Oh. <laughs> oh, I see. It turns you around. I was like, what the hell just happened? Hey, there's more rutabagas. Uh, yeah, I'm going to pick some. Sorry, Logan. I'm going to steal all of your goat's uh, snacks for myself. Oh, 
Well, at least we're gonna meet Grace at midnight. That's gonna be fun. And I otherwise have some commissions being worked on at the moment, so that's also good. Um. All right. I only have a few hours left to go before I go meet Grace. So I guess I'll start on finishing some things. It looks like Mabel's over here. I'm pretty sure she's the one I got a bunch of plastic pipe for. Whoa, I forgot. This happens every Saturday. Thank you. I guess I'll wait. I don't have much going on. So we have to go up to the church and meet Grace. I, 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 I don't know where the doors are. <laughs> they say below the Church of the Light. So where, where below? Yeah, I know I should rest, but... Oh my god, we're gonna notice the panda eyes on my character now. <laughs> oh my god, it's barely noticeable because he looks so goth anyways. Alright. From Arvio? Cryptid, thanks for coming with me to the library. I managed to dig up some more information and spent some time running back and forth to the research center. Anyway, I managed to get these two diagrams from Director Chi. Director Chi really is only second to Fang when it comes to being cold. Well, at least he doesn't have a raven. Uh, anyway, here are the diagrams for the plasticizer and glazing machine. Now it's up to you, the master builder, to bring this dream into reality. Just give them to me when you've finished. I still have some planning to do. I need to make sure I've got all this airtight if I'm going to convince Amira. By the way, it's a secret, so please don't tell her. And from City Hall. Oh yeah, the running of the Yakmo. Alright, now that it's daytime, let us look around the church again. Hey, what are you doing going to church, Yan? You don't seem like... I know he does. I know he goes every every Sunday, but he doesn't seem like the type. I swear I completed the other quests that are necessary for doing this. I just... I just... Howdy! Take her easy. Okay, so... As far as I can tell... There is one more thing that I need to wait for before I can do it anyways. So that is my bad for not even realizing that. Let's just go do some inspections and commissions. Because I don't think we're going to come across anything uh, special at the moment. How is there garbage up here? What the heck? Makes no sense. Oh, I'm hoping Elsie will return soon. I think she will. But I think that's going to be necessary for doing um, the next part of the quest that I'm on.
Also, actually, before I do all that, I need to uh, create a Yakmel station so that I can actually go to the Mole Cave Ruins easier. Oh, sorry, Mira, this will just have to wait. Hmm, well, there's... I guess I can turn in a commission. I was gonna say, there's really not much for me to do at the moment. Hurry up! I'm not even sure if I'm gonna be able to get to the mole cave today, seeing as, uh... I want to complete the Yakmel station. Before I go over there... Oh, I'll give this a minute. This only has... A very short time, so that's okay. Alright, let's head out there. God, already freaking late. You know, the battle music in this game is really quite, um, scary. I dig it, but it's definitely, like, you know you're entering a battle. Alright, time to put my builder to bed. Hopefully tomorrow we'll get some more story stuff. so good like that. Hey! Elsie! Pa! Don't shoot! Let me explain! Elsie! Get out of the way! I don't want to repeat the last time! What? 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 It's, it's duck. It, you're just whistling and it does what you're saying. What? Oh, Elsie, you're finally home. Why are you dressed different? Are you hurt? Let Ma take a look. And the duck. What's going on, hun? I ain't hurt. I'm fine. Ma, Pa, I've been working real hard. Been studying, looking at their habits, and I learned their ways. How to communicate with them real good. I call her Daisy. Poppycock! What you talking about, girl? Remember what happened to your ma? Oof. You know, ma, pa, I got something I want to say. Oh, heck, I'm just sorry, ma. I've just been acting a fool, really. I had a lot of time to think and... I'm just sorry for all my immature behavior before. Baby, as long as you're home safe, that's all me and your pa ever wanted. While I love this, and I love that she is growing up as a person, I don't feel like, what, five days is quite enough for that, but I will give it the benefit of the doubt because this is a game, so. I heard this one before. Now you're gonna be all good and do your chores, right? Then you're gonna get some dumb idea in your head and off we go again. But, Pa... What? Am I wrong? Missy, I raised you. I know what you're like. I'll give you a week. All right. I, this feels a bit weird. Normally you'd be arguing with me by now. I don't know how to reply to that. A week. I'm gonna show you. I've changed, Pa, and I'll be expecting an apology when this is over. <laughs> in your dreams, girly. All right, you're on. Now, get on in there. 
Your ma's making pie. Welcome home. That was cute. And no one gonna talk to me? I'm finally home. Check out my new threads. Pretty cool, right? I hope everyone didn't worry about me, though. I was just out learning to speak to animals. I mean, most people worried. <laughs> it's nice that she finally came back. I am still unsatisfied with how my builder looks. That's what I get for sticking with one look for the entire time and then changing it. Does this mean that Cryptid is going to go give their builder a makeover again? Just his hair and makeup, maybe. I'm not going to change his face or skin anymore. He's fine. Bit of a ghost, but fine. This means that I think I can do Grace's thing at midnight now. All right. I think this is the last time. I think he's actually kind of attractive Arm now. yourself with the weapon of fashion. Let Sandrock's very own papa take you for a Yeah, he's actually kind of cute now. Look at that. He did it. Finally, finally made him cute. I mean, he was cute purple, but... Um... <laughs> but trying to make him look human, and it's like, hmm... Oh, uh, hold on. What's going on in here? Is it Grace? Then three rock in a oh. row leapt at me. I just let out a yelp, a real sharp oof, and they froze. That gave me a lot of confidence. A woof, woof. That them barks there? They're the darn angriest sounds in the wolf language. Those rock in a rolls turned and ran on their heels. <laughs> but it sounds so cute when she does it. Oh my, Elsie, weren't you scared? Wow, your stories are even better than Owen's! Uh, that's not to say who we are. Don't enjoy your stories, Owen. But, oh well, you heard her. It's so exciting! Arvio, you have no tact. <laughs> <laughs> He's right, Elsie. I gotta start writing these down. The Legend of Elsie the Wolf Whisperer. <laughs> Sounds catchy, right? <laughs> I ain't just speaking wolf, you know. I got a whole host of animals I can talk to now. Got the whole monster whisperer thing going on. <sighs> Phew. Uh, sorry, y'all. I've been up for a few days now. I gotta get some rest. I'm so proud of her. Hey, I ain't seen you there. What you think of my new look? Uh, looks great. Tell me all about it. All right, ask away, bud. I know it must be all sorts of crazy seeing me like this. What should I ask? Oh my goodness. Can I ask all of these? Uh, how did you tame the duck? Tame? No, it ain't like that. Daisy's more like a bud, you know? Gotta get out of this taming mindset. Treat them like equals. You know, I agree with that, actually. Also, Daisy is cute in their official artwork. We went through quite some adventuring. Would take me a year to tell you, I reckon. After I spent some time with her, I feel like the Martle Duck species ain't that different from us folks. Oh, I can ask all these. Uh, what's with the change of clothes? Oh, those old ones got ripped up real bad. I managed to throw these ones together myself. Real durable lack. Plus, I reckon they make me look real mature. Don't you think? Like a real monster whisperer. They look like pirate clothes, but I dig it. All right, I was worried about you. What happened? Oh, nothing major. I had a few bumps in the lag, but got saved by some new friends of mine. I met these monster researchers from Atara. I ain't heard of them before, but they study monsters. Really knowledgeable. They look like a fun group. They had this monster hunter with them called Lizzie. She was real tough, like Howlet. Showed me all sorts of neat stuff. Said I got a knack for it, that I'd make a great tracker. Well, I think I asked all of these, so no more questions. <sighs> all right, I'm getting real sleepy now. I ain't slept for a few days. 
I reckon I'm asleep all week. Good for <sighs> you. You deserve it. I'll catch you later. Elsie's still a little sister to me, but I am so proud of her. All right. Any commissions to pick up? Um, why is the coat of paint mission saying I can go talk to Arvio? Let me go do that real quick. Unless it's talking to, uh, Amira. Also, you know, it's really cute that Arvio and Amira's parents named them with the A names. Ah, oh, I'd have been meaning to talk to you. Since you came and saw me, Arvio's been like a completely different person. I don't really think I've ever seen him this proactive before. I suppose I shouldn't look a gift horse in the mouth, but I can't help but feel like he's been avoiding me. Did you talk to him? Is he all right? Oh boy, um... Do I want to tell the truth or keep it a secret? I think it's nicer to keep it a mm, But, uh, hmm. Don't be mad at me, Arvio. I'm going to tell the truth because I really like your sister. Oh, I understand. Thank you for telling me. He's really trying his best, isn't he? I can't say I'm not a little proud of him. Don't worry. I'll keep your secret. Anyway, thank you. I really appreciate all you've done for us. Hello, did you get my letter? I know as well as anyone that you shouldn't rush art, but I would like to use my new kiln as soon as possible. I've had a lot of time to think about what to make first. Do you have a condenser for me, Amira? That's the thing I'm having trouble getting. One of the cool things about rocks is that you can stack them. Catch you later. I was like, where the heck am I going? Thank you. Right, I want to see if I can get on top of this train. I wonder when it's going to start moving again. Aha! Oh no! It went the other way! It's like, oh, oh, I want to get... And well, whatever. I'll try and find the next train. It is what it is. I need more petrified wood. Well, I guess I can go get that. Also, I just realized I can build the minecart. <laughs> I didn't even think about that. Well, 
I have to work on upgrading one of my machines. I actually should probably go see Chi because I don't even know if I have the recipe, but that's okay. Surprisingly, I do have the recipe. Also, you know something I need to do someday? Work on the museum. Actually get things in there. I have like three things. Maybe five. Somewhere between three and five. I'm just lazy. But I think I have quite a few sets of relics now just because I have the uh, Civil Corps pick stuff up for me. I have resized my home again. Um, I will add more rooms when I have more money. But hey, looking good otherwise. I will also get myself a stable soon. I promise. So now the question is, will I be able to do that thing with Grace tonight? Like obviously I've been waiting up till past midnight to see if I can do it, but now that Elsie's home I hope I can do it. I will have to get back home soon, I just want some petrified wood. I can turn something into someone. Hey Pablo. Howdy. Hmm. There we go. I've turned in a commission to Pablo. Oh my. My ore refinery needs stuff. Andy, what are you doing out at this hour? Shouldn't you be in bed? I think I'll put my builder to bed. I have a letter according to the game, as far as I can tell. Love that that can happen right after midnight. All right, who's it from? Oh, from Nia. What? Wait, you can't mean <gasps> Logan. So if he's a good guy, then who's the bad guy? This is getting too dangerous. We're going to have to do an emergency extraction quick. Take annual leave, get on your train home. <gasps> I can acquire relationship points. Okay. Well, I don't really want to stop, but I think I will end it here. I uh, I don't entirely know where to go for uh, the fall from grace, so uh, I will have to figure that out. But I've been recording for almost two hours, so I think it's time. So thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please hit that like button. And if you want to see more of me, but you haven't yet subscribed, please subscribe. I upload videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Saturday, and sometimes extras and shorts randomly throughout the week. I also stream on Twitch on Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. Fridays are usually twice a month, but they've been known to be more and sometimes less. And I hope to see you all next time. Bye.